The woman charged with second degree murder in a deadly drunk driving crash more than three years ago learned her sentence today. She'll spend at least 17 years behind bars for the death of 65 year old Pavlos Dion of Frazier. Larry Spruill with what Janelle Bailey had to say as she went before the judge today. And no matter what uh, amount of time that I give you, I can never, uh, it's never going to restore a life. Bold words, but the honest truth from a local judge Wednesday morning, just moments before Janelle Bailey learned her fate. Bailey, wrapped up with chains, stood in front of the judge years after police said she hit and killed Pablos Dion back in June of 2016, around 1045 that night. Police said Bailey driving a green Dodge Caravan struck Dion's Chrysler Sebring at the traffic light at Chesterfield, just south of 10 Mile Road in East Point. Dion died at the scene. This is not Bailey's first DUI. This time she's charged with second degree murder, DUI and operating while license suspended, causing death. Bailey was found guilty of all charges, and four years later of court hearings and appeals, she would face a judge for sentencing but not before Bailey's son, Anthony Collier, and Bailey addressed the court. Nobody wins right now. Everybody's at a loss. Your family lost a family member, and physically we're losing a family member as well. First, I would like to apologize to the family and friends of Mr. Dion, as well as to my family and friends. This tragedy affected many lives, and I apologize for the pain I've caused. Ma'am, it is the sentence of the court that you be sentenced to the Michigan Department of Corrections for, for a term of 204 months to 480 months with credit for 1,330 days served. I'll see y'all all soon. I love all y'all. And Bailey did tell the judge that she started drinking right after her mother passed away from cancer, but she did say that is not an excuse. We're live tonight. Larry Sproul, Local 4. Yeah. All right, Larry, thanks.